Sam Spade cool. Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host and midshipman of Mysterioso Ken Levine. I am a singer and vocal coach here on YouTube and today we are looking at Gustavo Cerati uh, who is an Argentinian super rock star god uh, and his single or song Cremen. But before we do that, I just would like to remind you all to please remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the great stuff we do here every week on the channel. Now, that is all said and done with. Um, this comes as a request by uh, a subscriber by the name of Funny Dogs, which caught my attention because I have a funny dog named Katie, and she's very sweet. And so I thought, oh, maybe this might be really good. And plus, too, uh, uh, Gustavo Chorate is a singer, songwriter, rock legend I have no knowledge of. I've, I do not know this performer at all. So this was really intriguing to me. Um, and that, that's not really unsurprising, actually. There's a lot of great performers and great singers that I have no knowledge of that you might have knowledge of, and maybe you can point me into their direction. So now, without further ado, let's listen to this official music video, Kremen, uh, I believe from 2010, so uh, 10 years old. He, uh, the, I did look up a little bit about uh, Gustavo Cerati, or is it Cerati? Um, if I'm saying that wrong, please point me right in the in the direction down below, um, in the comments down below. All right. I did look up crimen means crime. Uh, this video has no uh, uh, subtitles, so um, my Spanish is bad. I, I'm just going to say that, so I don't know. I believe this is sung in Spanish, but I'm just going to make that assumption. Si algo aprendí en esta ciudad es que no hay garantías. Nadie te regala nada. Todo podía Smoking terminar a terriblemente mal. In an electric blue este suit gets into a 1940s Dodge. <laughs> Don't know. La espera me agotó. No sé nada. A lot of photographers there. Okay, I'm getting sort of like a, a film noir uh, vibe here, uh, obviously with the, the late model car and the smoking the cigarette to the car and, and a very sort of Humphrey Bogart, Maltese Falcon, femme fatale there, smoking a cigarette with a cigarette holder. Um, okay, so that's the vibe of the video. I, I, it sounds like a piano ballad off the top here. Tanto en mí. En llamas me acosté en un lento degradé. Supe que te perdí. Pretty windy in the office. So I'm assuming that is Gustavo Cerati right there uh, singing the song. Um, is that right? Uh, he's come alive. <clears throat> I want to go back to, this sounds like the chorusy bit here when he comes alive. ¿Qué otra cosa? So when I'm listening to this, I'm thinking there's there's something very authentic about the vocal um, in that uh, I don't hear a lot of um, sort of traditional pop vocal compression 
uh, going on in the vocal. I don't hear a lot of, um, you know, what you might call vocal sweetening, meddling with the vocal. Um, it, it sounds like this is like authentically his voice, his singing. Um, it's very easy. Uh, he's doing uh, a nice breathy technique to sort of make things a little bit more intimate and um, and as well as, you know, th there doesn't seem to be a huge range for him to expand outward into. Uh, so, but v very smooth. I'm, I'm digging it. It's good. And, and uh, yeah, very sort of um, maybe not, it's sort of like a mid-tempo ballady thing. <laughs> it's all about love. Something about love is a crime. <laughs> Something, something's happened and a crime has been committed. Kirby, Peeping Tom. Sam Spade, cool. I love that core change there. That's What's he doing there? Okay, so the beginning of the song, I gotta say, it wasn't, it wasn't anything really fabulous or showy or flashy uh, about the vocal. It was just a nice, clean vocal and uh, very authentic, um, not trying too hard. And then here we go into this chorus. <laughs> That's really cool how he does this sort of mel melismatic passage down out of tempo. La da da. I I'm, I did a bad impersonation. <laughs> okay. okay, so in the video here, he's just not even trying. It's just so easy. I, I don't know if that is <clears throat> how he performs live. I, maybe I should have chosen a live version of this song to review, to look at. So if that is an, a, an example of his technique and his style, that's, that's nice to see that um, he has that range and capacity to do that with ease. Uh, as a rock singer, sometimes you hear them sort of like, eh, you know, and this is just all relaxed. Look at that. Good technique. I'm just going to... Look at that. No problem. It's pretty far, far back in the mix in my headphones. I like that. That's good. Okay. All right. So thank you, Funny Dogs, for suggesting I check out Gustavo Chorati. 
that was interesting. I uh, I enjoyed that. I thought the track was kind of fun, and uh, the video was entertaining. And I did find that uh, there was some interesting vocal things that he was doing there, uh, Gustavo Chorati. And I I wonder though if this is. Um, Maybe just a, a thin slice of what he's capable of because I, I didn't necessarily get the sense that this was like the best vocalist I've ever heard. Um, I think there's uh, there is some there's great vocals there and he's got a good voice. I just would like to hear more of the the thing, the thing that makes it makes Gustavo Charati so totally unique and interesting. So okay, cool. Um, yeah, hey, if you have a suggestion. Um, please leave that in the comments down below. Uh, let me know what you think. And uh, let me know what you think of Gustavo Charati, what you think of this video. And also, too, I usually end off my videos with a little bit of a commercial for what it is that I do, what I'm currently doing right now, and that is uh, helping uh, young vocalists, uh, or uh, anyone, actually, uh, discover their voice and um, really figure out what it is that they want to do with their technique. If they're having trouble, maybe provide a little bit of guidance uh, along the way. And... Yeah, if you want to reach out to me, I will be sure to leave a link down in the description below and uh, you can get a hold of me at my Wizio page or at uh, KenLevineVocalCoach.com. And as always, please remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell um, uh, uh, so you don't miss out on any of the great stuff we produce here every week on the channel. Yeah, so if you've made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time.